hello everyone in this video I'm going to show you how to read and write to a file in TCL uh, this is very important tutorial because in NS2 script we need to save our results so here I will show you how to read from a file and how to write to a file so before performing read and write operation we need to open the file first so there is a command open and then we need to write name of file and then we need to specify mode so there are five modes so first mode R that is for read W for write E for appending so in case if our file is having some content and we are performing a writing operation so if that file is opened in append mode so the previous content will remain in file and our writing will start at the end of the file R plus mode it will allow read and write operation and W plus mode it also allow write and read operation so first of all what I'm going to do I'm going to create a file and I will write something to that file so for that thing I need to open that file in W mode or let's say W plus mode because we will read that file after performing write operation so when we run this command this command actually will run a file handle so we will store that file handle in a variable now next thing what I want to do I want to print I want to write something to this file so we need to use the command puts $app and write your message here so let's say welcome to NS2 tutorials and once your work is done just close the file handle save this file execute your program and let's see is there any file created with 1.txt so here's the file and here is our content so in the next program we will going to see how to read from a file so here you can change the mode if you want but uh, this mode also allow you read operation but for simplicity let's change it read and how to read so get as dollar f and in which variable you want to read the content of this file so i'm creating a i'm using this variable d and then i am printing value of d and at the end i'm closing this file handler so let's execute this program again so as you can see uh, the content of file is paste stored in this variable and then we have printed it successfully so these are the basic operation and I think these are sufficient for our NS2 script. Thank you very much for watching.